had chills go through my body to know that he was out there alone. A mother's only son. He didn't deserve this. Left clinging to his life. He was left in the road to die like a dog. It was on March 13th when Brandon Whiteside was discovered on Jefferson Boulevard after being hit by a vehicle. The driver left the scene. Whiteside was taken to University Hospital in critical condition. My son's pelvis is shredded. His bladder is bleeding. His kidneys are not working right now. His foot was torn away from his leg. His mother, Joanne Simmons, has been by his side every step of the way. This is just a mystery. He just wants to know why. He wants to know why him. And I don't have those answers as a mother. It hurts me. As she desperately searches for answers, not only for her son. He doesn't remember anything. But for his infant daughter. He still hasn't got to see his grandbaby, my grandbaby, since he's been here. We're not here to criminalize anybody. We just want to know what happened. While Whiteside recovers here at UofL Hospital, he is expected to survive. Doctors say, though, he could be disabled for the rest of his life. In Louisville, Trey Ward, WLKY News.